rolling into week number 16 <clears throat> in the NFL. Thank you so much for joining me. You're watching Picks with David. It's the Thursday night football game for week 16. But before we get to that, let's just talk about real quickly. Week 15 was a wild one. The comebacks, the craziness, three huge comebacks, including the biggest comeback in NFL history. The Cincinnati Bengals came back against the team that they played, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, by 17 points down. Then you had the Minnesota Vikings with the greatest comeback in NFL history, down 33 to nothing at halftime. The Jacksonville Jaguars with a big comeback against the Dallas Cowboys. And so, just like we always say, this is why they play the games. You can never count the other team out. You must play the full 60 minutes. And I think that tonight's game is going to be one of those 60-minute battles. So let's take a look. The 6-8 Jacksonville Jaguars at the 7-7 seven seven New York Jets. Both of these teams are in the thick of the playoff hunt. Jacksonville is actually close to winning their division if they continue to win. What a surprise that would be. A great job being done by head coach Doug Peterson and his staff this year in Jacksonville. The reason they're able to do that is because Tennessee has faltered down the stretch here. Now, they have an easy winnable game against the Houston Texans, you would think, but the Texans have played against the Chiefs and the Cowboys very tough the last two weeks. So don't be surprised if the Jacksonville Jaguars are in the lead of the division here really soon. We got three weeks to go. And both of these teams are looking to secure a playoff spot. There are seven spots now in the playoffs. Over the last couple of years, it's gone from six to seven. The Jets are going to start Zach Wilson again, who they hope to be their quarterback of the future. He makes mistakes from time to time, and I think he just needs a little bit more seasoning. But he's got weapons on this team. He's got Garrett Wilson to get the ball to. I also like some of their other receivers, Elijah Moore. They can run the football, and they've been doing that despite the loss of Brees Hall to an ACL tear earlier in the season. The addition of James Robinson has come over, but Knight has been the lead back. And although they have Michael Carter, they have been doing a rotation with the three runners to keep them fresh. Defensively, the Jets are one of the better teams in the NFL, but they're going to be playing against a team that's really starting to come on on offense in the Jacksonville Jaguars. Trevor Lawrence is starting to look like the number one pick that he was supposed to be when he was drafted. One of the few things that Urban Meyer did right in his tenure at Jacksonville. And they're running the football effectively with the tandem of Travis Etienne and James Hasty. Now, for me, or Jermichael Hasty, I should say. For me, I think this comes down to the Jets are playing at home. Both teams know that they have a playoff spot on the line. Defense usually, you know, overcomes offense, but I really like the Jacksonville Jaguars in this game, and that's who I'm going to take. I think the Jaguars win the game on Thursday night football. Let's see what happens. During this season on Thursday night football, my record so far on the Thursday night games is 10-7. and seven. And so hopefully I continue my winning ways over the last couple of weeks. I have an overall 10-7 and seven record on the Thursday night games. But once again, I like Jacksonville. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Happy holidays. We'll see you, you know, for the special games coming up here 
starting on Christmas Eve. Saturday's got a full slate of games. We've got Sunday with a full with a good slate of games on Christmas, and then of course Monday night football. I'll be making a couple of different videos for all of that stuff there. Join me again real soon. Like and subscribe the video so you don't miss anything. Thanks again for joining me. We'll see you Saturday for Big Week 16 in the NFL.